this is 29 months on HRT as of yesterday. And this week, um, I've been having a few issues. Um, I want my breasts bigger. I want cup size. That's been the biggest one. And surgery. And my doctor did, I was telling her that my breasts started growing slower, like much slower than what they've been. Um, she added, added, it was Provera, it's hydroxyprogesterone is what it is. Um, so that's what was added and I'm taking that now and it has helped. The breasts are a little fuller, but it's not quite as full as it should be, it's just a little bit. It seems like a little bit more fat though than tissue. It's the tissue is what I need, especially on the sides here, because without that tissue on the sides, a lot of clothes don't fit right, like bras mostly. Um, so I have to find bras that will work with that while they're still growing. So other than that, still losing leg hair and. Yeah, when I wasn't fry yesterday, Friday, but it was the Friday before, there was a dream I had. It's because this was the dream it was. I had my own baby girl that was biological and everything. And I was breastfeeding her. And it's one of those kind of dreams where you can actually feel it. When I woke up, I could still feel it. So that's something interesting that has happened. I woke up and feel I like I could still feel it and it's like I was like nursing her and everything. And the thing is I've been really wanting my more so wanting my own biological daughter. I've been wanting one so bad but I can't get pregnant and that sucks. Can't have periods or any of that, so I could get pregnant. All that fun kind of stuff. But other than that, I'm doing good. This is what I want my breasts to look like. They have my um, fashion forms in. This is what I want them to look like without them. See how the size with them in. How much bigger and fuller that is. That's how I really want them to look when they're done growing. And I already decided if they're not there, which is it's weird how I measure, because when I measure, I'm measuring 37 inches, which makes me see cup, but. C's don't really, some C's fit like a B cup, which is weird. Some C's fit, and some C's fit like a D cup, and I'm like, okay. So, I want to be 38 inches. That'll make me a D, and I know bras will fit better, and so, yeah. And I've been really wanting this surgery. So I can get that corrected down there. And the other thing is, I've been really wanting. There's a night where I woke up in the, yeah, I woke up in the middle of the night last week. And I really, really wanted to have sex badly. But. Is I wanted to have it in male, female kind of a way, um, but I don't have the surgery down there that yet 
for that to happen that way, so it was frustrating in the fact that I like girls because I'm lesbian. Um, with the boys' sexual tendency, not tendencies, not sex part. Um, if I don't want it, it's kind of complicated though. Other than that, um, everything's except for my emotions going up and down because the progesterone or the element drugs progesterone because of that I've been crying a little bit more and whatnot and when I took it the last time before I stopped taking it it wasn't really helping but this time it seems to be helping more the medroxypentrestrone, so. Well, other than that, um, comment, rate, and subscribe, and click the link down there to donate to my surgery. The surgery funds down there, and the link to it, to donate down there to help. And the link to my blog's down there if you haven't seen it yet. It's down there.